you doing? Jamie O'Sullivan here, PGA Professional and Rossler Golf Links. I'd like to welcome you here to the sixth hole, the sixth tee box on a beautiful short par four. Uh, I want to talk to you today about a good pre-shot routine. Uh, in golf, pre-shot routine literally is a plan. Uh, a plan on what we want to do with the golf ball, what club we want to use, depending on the day, the conditions, um, what sort of shot we're trying to play, and also a kind of routine and setup. Okay. So a good pre-shot routine should be, after you've chosen your club for the specific shot you want, I want you to make sure you aim the club first where you want to go. After you aim the club, you aim your body. After you aim your body, make sure you're set up nice and strong, and bang, off you go. So uh, this needs to happen very, very quickly and naturally, and this may take some time to practice. Uh, I'm just gonna very quickly go through what I, um, what I just said there, and a good pre-shot routine should literally take a couple of seconds. It's a bit like when you learned how to drive. There was a lot of things to remember at the start and it took you a while to get comfortable at it, but now you do it without even thinking. So the very first thing is we want to do is we want to make sure the club face is aimed where we want the ball to go. Club face is responsible for, I suppose it, it's 70% responsible for where the ball actually goes uh, at the immediate start flight. Of, so it's very important that we aim that correctly first. On the ground in front of me here, I have obviously my golf ball, and I have two sticks, two alignment sticks. This one here represents where I want the ball to go, so it's the ball to target line, and this is where my body is aimed, which is parallel to the ball to target line. So very simply what I've done, I go in and I always aim the club first. So I'm gonna get the club perpendicular to this, have a quick look up to make sure that I'm happy where I'm going. Next thing I do is I put my left foot a small bit out, my right foot a big bit out, so that my body is parallel to the ball's target line. Why I put my left foot a small bit out is because I'm using a wood here and I want the ball position up in front of me. Then what I do is I take my grip and I get into a good posture, good strong posture, hips back, chin and chest up. So now I'm ready to go. So in reality, it looks like this. And let's give it away. Not bad at all. 